Since you can now get a COVID-19 test without a doctor's order, we're seeing longer lines at testing sites throughout the triangle. CBS 17 is getting answers tonight. Our Crystal Price is live at a testing site in Durham where people waited for hours. Crystal. Yeah, there were definitely long lines here today, and they're expecting the same thing tomorrow as now. Just about anybody can get tested. The lines formed early at this Walgreens testing site. So I just decided I'd uh, wake up this morning early and get in line. A line wrapping around the intersection of Horton and Guess Roads, where dozens waited to get tested for COVID-19. It's just slow moving, but uh, I was told that I should be able to be seen today. E.B. Bartlett got in line at 6 a.m. He didn't have an appointment. He just filled out a form online and showed up. After waiting for five hours, he finally made it into the parking lot. And I actually just got in on an international flight last night, and uh, the CDC's recommends uh, you self-quarantine for 14 days. Before he sees his kids after returning home, he wants to make sure he didn't contract the virus overseas. You certainly don't want to put other people at risk so and I would have no problem doing that in North Carolina it's gotten easier to get tested this week the state's saying you no longer need to have a doctor's order all you have to do is meet the CDC's criteria which means you either have symptoms or think you may have been exposed at this Walgreens location the tests are free and it's a nasal swab you administer yourself it's just the whole part of the testing is Making sure you don't come in contact with people. Make sure that uh, you're, I'm doing my part, so it's all a group effort. And while this location is taking walk-ins, they are still asking people to make appointments. For more information on that, go to our website at CBS17.com. Reporting live in Durham, Crystal Price, CBS 17 News.